Hey everybody, one of Weezum here, 9 p.m. exactly. This is the 25 digit code uh, for the booster pack access from the GameStop pre order Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare. Toys R Us has the deal, $10 off involved. GameStop had a deal, you pre order it, I guess you're buying an early release of the game type situation. You get the booster packs. Initially, based on what they had online, it literally looked like a pack of cards was going to come. You know, packed inside the game case. I don't know if they'd be characters, power-ups, items, things of that nature, but I figured it'd be literally like kind of a trading card type deal with just a code on it. Uh, when you come in here, I think it's somewhere in the in-game menu more, I believe, and then it has redeem code inside that folder. But uh, you can apparently scan QR codes uh, with the Connect Center. I was unaware of that. Um, Sadly, uh, oh, the GameStop receipt did not include the QR code. So what it did include, though, is the 25-digit code, which I painstakingly entered. And the first time uh, I did this, it was apparently not correct, or there's some issues. So I've double-checked it. This is the code. So we're going to press Enter here and uh, see, you know, hopefully, uh, what we get if it's done correctly this time. All right, so use prepaid code PVZ Garden Warfare pre-order offer. Subject to the Xbox Live. There are no refunds. I don't have Xbox Live. I guess we'll confirm that. Success. You can now own PVZ Garden Warfare pre-order offer. I don't know what that is. That's what I was hoping I could find here. Um. What exactly did we get there? Um, okay. Pre-order packs, thank you. Um, yeah, I guess we'll just launch that. I don't really know what to do. Sticker shop. Purchase new. That's great. I get, let's just open this and see what we have in here. Alright, friendly welcome pack. We probably should have opened this before my nephew and I uh, ventured off. I'm betting there's probably the plants that you can actually plant in the small pot, so... My zombie friends, I come with gifts. Gifts will help you get brains. Spectacular character pack. Contains five items. Let's see what this message is. Okay, just email. Um, spectacular pack. Rare, super rare, gravy salad, super duper pack, five items, both custom and consumable, uh, crazy pack, reinforcement packs, okay, now we're getting to the stuff you have to spend money on, um, 1,000, 5,000, 10,000, super premium, 20,000, and spectacular character pack, 40,000, so... Let's see, seven items. Is that the same as this one? Yeah, so I'm guessing... I don't exactly know what was included. I should have clicked this tab apparently beforehand. But, uh... You get the idea. I'm not exactly sure what we unlocked. I'm assuming it must have been the crazy pack since it's also for sale. Um, and it could have been these others as well. I don't exactly know. But... I guess, just to make this video worth your while, since I don't really know what was here beforehand. I'm assuming the welcome pack was here. The others, I'm not... I really don't know. It's 50-50. Uh, Crazy Dave has donated this helpful pack of whatnots to help your cause. Let's go ahead and open that. Alright, so... I guess we got like a character sticker that's a part of the chomper. Um, collect all five character stickers to unlock new characters. Uh, in here we got the P Gatling. Uh, there are consumable plants. P Cannon. Heal Flower. Uh, Self Revive. That would have been helpful earlier. <laughs> Apply a tattoo to really stand out from the crowd. Potted Cap. Taken. Peace Chase. So what was uncommon in here? Anything? I guess the that was rare. So, um, okay, we'll continue. 
Uh, brain packs for zombies. Let's go ahead and open that up. Wow. This one looks impressive. Uh, character sticker, we got a piece of that. Um, coffin zombie. That's pretty cool. That's a rare one. Uh, uncommon is the buckethead zombie. Conehead zombie, uncommon. Uh, brown coat zombie, also uncommon. Uh, crossbones, common. Buffalo, curly, and swimming goggles, which are common. I guess you can equip that on your character. Um, spectacular character pack. Now that one also overlaps. They want 40,000 for that. Five items, some are guaranteed to unlock a rare, super rare. So let's go ahead and uh, check this one out. Alright, wow. Okay. Uh, collect all five character stickers to unlock new characters. Literally, we got everything we need, all five pieces, to get a new character unlocked, the Commando P, which he looks awesome. I'm sure my nephew wishes it was, you know, the uh, frozen guy, but you get the idea. So that's how the stickers are going to work, obviously. When you complete it, uh, I guess you'll get the new characters. Uh, the Super Duper Pack. Mix of both custom and consumables. Guaranteed one uncommon. Let's go ahead and open that. Alright, so we got yellow buds. Uh, change the organic features of your plants. Straw hat, that's fitting for the cactus. Oh, can be equipped. Uh, oranges. Change out the organic features. Right here we got a common one, the Garden Ops Self Revive. And right here, brown coat zombie. So we'll continue on. I apologize. I should have opened these as I went through, but I'm literally I'm just doing all this on the fly, obviously. So um, my apologies there. This is the crazy pack, though. As mentioned earlier, you're looking at ten grand for this thing, and um, again, I'm assuming it ties in with the pre-order bonus at this point. But uh, let's go ahead and open it up. Oh wow, this is some cool stuff. Alright, we got our second piece of that guy, the I guess the all-star zombie. That would be wicked cool. Um, I guess it's his arm. That's helpful. You know. Uh, hardened skin, that's super rare. Uh, Chomper, it's increased health. Okay. Chomper's already pretty pretty respectable, so I'm happy with that. Face paint, it's a little tattoo. You can apply that there. Um, zombie consumables, summon these helpful zombies to attack plants and capture the garden. Which, I can't play that because I'm not online with live gold yet. <laughs> so, skip challenge star will complete any challenge if you don't feel like achieving it yourself. That would come in handy, two of those I guess. Three brown coat zombies, uncommon. And uh, the goatee. I have to say that would look pretty cool on some of the zombies. So We'll continue there. That's about it. I mean, you kind of now I'm getting the feel for obviously the in-game cash, the potted plants makes sense now. Um, I think the welcome pack would have been there. The other booster packs, they may have all been special uh, with the pre-order bonus, but uh, reinforcement packs, you can obviously pick that up. A thousand, that's not too hard to get to since we've taken care of that. Uh, the super duper pack, we covered that. Uh, crazy pack. I guess what we ought to save up for, which we'll probably have to purchase more of the consumables to get there, uh, especially if we stick to the offline co-op, that'll take a while, but uh, the super premium pack, nine items, high likelihood of characters, items, and weapon upgrades, guaranteed at least one super rare item, and has likelihood, best likelihood of a super rare character piece, so uh, that's going to be desirable. Spectacular character pack, uh, five items, and all our summer guaranteed to unlock a rare or super rare character. So, um, kind of saw that with the uh, Commando P shooter. But that's pretty much that. I guess we'll back out of here, and I guess we can go into the sticker book now and uh, take a look at that. Kind of got some peaceful music in here. <laughs> um, all right, so. It's kind of cool I hadn't been in here. I thought it would literally just be the stickers, but it's literally our stacks. Or stats, I should say. Um, 6 KOs versus 150 kills. I feel good about that. The accuracy is horrible. Um, that's to be expected, I suppose. But, uh, kind of highlights everything here for you. Let's take a look at this. 
Okay. Football cannon. Some really cool stuff. Um, back out of here. Let's go to... Let's check out the chomper. We got some stuff on him. Alright. Um, got the hardened skinned. Apparently, I guess that's automatic, maybe. Um, got the goop. We got the burrow. Obviously, we need more stuff here. Cactus, long range specials. This is pretty cool, kind of like a yearbook. Uh, stat archive of the characters and everything. So, um, current collection of all spawnable zombies. I don't know, it's just kind of some cool stuff in here. I won't bore you with it. Um, I'll just go ahead and back out. But um, if you did not pre order at GameStop and you came in and you just had the welcome pack, everything that you saw past that's what you would have got if you pre ordered at GameStop. If you're looking to get the game and you're debating the $10 savings at Toys R Us going to Walmart because it's closest to you, you're going to GameStop, uh, keep in mind whatever. You see other people have that didn't go to GameStop, that's what was included. My apologies for not being more precise here. Uh, literally, I'm just winging this as we go. So, um, Like I said, though, I guess at the time I pre-ordered, I didn't know Toys R Us was going to have the $10 deal. But uh, I don't mind paying the $39 and getting that. So, um, Game is a ton of fun. That kind of showcases how the card packs work. You know, the sticker shop, your sticker book, things like that. So, uh, as I get time to play the game with my nephew, uh, we'll kind of earn some more cash, work towards getting some more things. Once I kind of fill that up more, we'll kind of go through the sticker book. Right now, there's really not a lot to see, but uh, that's that. Hopefully, it helps you out a little bit. I will quit rambling, but I have to say, the game definitely a lot of fun. Again, if you've got the good internet and don't mind the, you know, subscription fees and everything, uh, you're probably having an absolute blast online, but um, based on the little bit we can do in the offline co-op, I mean, the game... I don't have anything bad to say about it aside from what I've covered already, so uh, I'll leave it at that, but uh, again, hopefully everyone's enjoying this, and uh, despite me not checking in there to see what was available ahead of time, uh, you should be able to figure it out for yourself based on other things you see or what your version had, uh, what the bonus entails, so... Uh, I'll leave it at that. Again, you can follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, circle me on Google+, Plus, whichever you prefer. Again, thanks for watching, and we will catch you back here for more Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare.